Let's take a look at the pH of milk. The question is whether milk is an acid, base, or neutral. We'll look at it with pH paper and then a pH meter to get a more accurate reading. So we take some milk. This is whole milk that I got from the grocery store and we pour it on the Petri dish. So we'll use our pH paper to determine whether milk is an acid or a base. So the pH paper, that's that yellow paper, and I drop it in the milk and immediately it turns kind of green. That green color we can compare to the key here, to our pH paper, and we can tell that the pH is right around 6 or 7, somewhere between 6 and 7. It's kind of hard to tell with pH paper exactly what the pH is, but we can say it's between 6 and 7. A pH of 7 is considered neutral. Below 7 is acidic, so milk, according to our pH paper, is acidic. And this makes sense. Milk tastes a little bit sour. That's usually an indication that we have an acid. So we can confirm the pH of milk, get a more accurate reading using a pH meter. So I've calibrated my pH meter, and when I put it in the milk, it's going to read the pH out to two decimal places. So we let it equilibrate, and it goes to 6.59. So just like our pH paper told us, milk has a pH that's between 6 and 7. So milk is acidic because its pH is below 7, but it's only slightly acidic. As milk sits out, it'll create more lactic acid and become more acidic as it goes sour. This is Dr. B with the pH of milk. Thanks for watching.